What is up, boss ones? This is Awesome Perfect One here. Welcome back to a new Let's Play. As we're going to be playing the game that you awesome ones have non stop been suggesting, and all you Yowie fangirls and fanboys out there just wouldn't let go of it. And I'm talking about Dramatical Murder. Apparently, there's an anime to this. I have never seen the anime. I've never even heard of the anime until, eh, I would say, half a year ago. That's when I first heard about it. And when I heard anything about dramatical murder in general, to be honest. And, man, all the things I hear about it are either... Well, I, I hear good things about it, but I also hear weird things about it. So, I think you also made me chose this game, or making me play this game. So, I can have a reaction to it. So, that's going to be very interesting. I don't know what to expect. In all honesty, I don't know what to expect. I'm kind of nervous. But, I'm also excited because I like... I like surprises. No other... I, I haven't seen anyone else play this. I haven't seen anything else. So, I'm just going to go straight into this. Empty-minded and... Yeah, just prepare myself, I guess. Are your bodies prepared? Because my body is definitely prepared. I... I'm excited, so yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and begin. Ooh, access. Access to what? And why is it called Dramatical Murder? Like, it makes me think it's like a, I don't know, like a thriller type of like mystery thing, but I can most definitely be wrong. I don't know what this is. Uh, yes, I did really came. <laughs> I, is, is this like telling me I shouldn't be here? You were waiting. You're always waiting for me? Luca? Is that you? Hurry to me. Her Who am I hurrying to? D destroy me. Oh, oh, destroy you. Oh, okay. I am so down with that, Luca chan. <laughs> with your power. Okay, I'll th I let's be honest. We all thought I was going to say penis or something. <laughs> going into this game, you would think that would be it. With your power, though. So, so much, like, mm, so much emotion into that sentence. There's a lot into it. Hello? Hi. Junk Shop Haybon? Alrighty, then. Hmm. I don't know what to think yet. S2 type. What? Where does he work at? Ooh, I like the. Okay. Okay. So this is a different visual novel than I, uh. Kind of pictured in my mind so far. Like the art style and stuff. Uh, Arigato. Etto. <laughs> so no ono. But Hi. Oh, is that us? Is that our sexy character? This is This is This is not a dating thing. This is not like a phone sex type of thing. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> It's gonna be that type of game. It's gonna be that type of game. This is what you asked when chose for me. Oh boy. You're grateful. So is this how he gets his orders by using his sexy voice? Man, he must be a good salesman. <laughs> Whoever this is, I don't know who this is. S2 custom parts I still don't know where he works at. I think the guy just wants to talk to him. He's paying 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 to talk to he is a great salesman. Uh, what? Oh, 
特別なご案内ですのでご予約いただければ。Oh, as a service. しますよ Oh, now that's an offer you don't want to pass up. Oh no, I'm getting the wrong ideas. Unless I'm really like. Oh no, what type of service? Service. <laughs> I like. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I like the way he said that. Service. <laughs> It's awesome. It's awesome. It makes me cringe in a good way. Oh, wow. You're actually gonna meet up with him? Wow. wow. He must be employee of the month every month. What's your shop? I don't know what this is. Oh my goodness. Domo. Domo. <laughs> You're probably so tired of being handsome. As soon as I hang up the phone, I let out a huge sigh. Okay, so this is me. I don't think I could talk like that. I don't have that much. I don't have that much of a handsome voice. <laughs> Although I do it knowingly. Speaking to the customers as ulterior ulterior motives, it's really annoying. Well, if it goes well, I'm sure to sell something, so it's fine. Your voice is so wonderful. I need to meet you no matter what. Among the people who contacts our shop by phone, there are an awful lot of guys who say that. Wow. Wow. That is a very interesting town, but I'm not even gonna lie to that. You definitely have an interesting, great, wonderful voice. They want to meet me when they all know that when they all know is my voice. If I was a woman, it'd be better, but usually a guy wouldn't ask another guy something like that. Nope, not often at all. Just in this world. <laughs> at first, I could handle them well, but like anyone else would, I become irritated when it kept happening. I feel that's a good problem though, but that's just me, I'm just saying. But it also became easier to entice customers to buy products. Exactly what I was saying earlier. From then on, like that phone call just now, I could e make even more sales. Strangely enough though, it doesn't happen in the actual shop. Sometimes a customer actually comes to meet me after a telephone call, but I just play it off. They all end up leaving without noticing I was the owner of that voice. How would they not recognize that? Unless. You have multiple voices. <laughs> Since there's not much harm done, I just think, well, whatever, and leave it be. <laughs> I am living the life. <laughs> I am a salesman using my sexy voice <laughs> to attract customers to buy my products. I am like a different type of prostitute or something, or I don't know. Sex. Phone person. I don't know what the heck you call it. I stretch out, I stretch my arms out wide and place my eyes on my digital clock and on the counter. This is a pretty cool shop, though. Oh, it's a junk shop. I'm so stupid. I'm such a baka sometimes. This shop provides a variety of things, ranging from small expendable supplies to specialized metal parts at a bargain price. Junk shop high bon. I was attracted by the subtleness of the store name and started working here. I wonder how long it's been. Anyway, it was a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Is that. Is my name Face? Hey, I mean, if your name's Face and you're watching this, I, that's cool with me. That's a good name, I think. I just never heard of that name. It's very unique. I was spacing out and had my elbow on the counter when the coil on my arm rang. A coil is something like a mobile phone, but it's much more convenient than just that. Phone calls, message, payments, identification, and of course watching TV can all be done with this one machine. How can that sound so- Oh my god, I just totally recognize that. 69! Ha 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 ha! Do you see that? That smiling face? You might not see it because of my face. I don't know. That- I, I'm so- I'm so mature. And Hepsi Avenue. Okay, well, I'm already seeing some references. Anywho. That reminds me of something, though. There was a movie, I remember, that one thing for, like, you had one device or one tattoo or something that was, that works for everything. I, I don't know what it was. I don't remember. Oh, that's cool, though. That is nifty. Captive princess. Pfft, screw the princess. Wait, hold on. So you got about what I asked for from Haiga-san this Sunday from Kojaku. How are you from Mizuki? Dinner from Granny? About then, Kojuku, or Kajaku? Oh, it's Kojo, uh, Kojaku. And please save me, Captive Princess. 
Yeah, what Cat of Princess? Is it a new kind of advertising? The adult kind, maybe? It does sound like it. I wouldn't... But wouldn't it be in spam unless the spam mail just doesn't work? <laughs> just like it does now. It still doesn't, like, work properly. It'll probably continue like, Please help me! I'm troubled by my aching body! Or something. <laughs> Delete. I, I would have checked it. Oh, as I was handling my coil, something slammed into my waist. I fell, I, I fall from my chair, and some of the heavy lands on my back. Three giggling voices. The cool pretend to be... Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't tell me they're into me. Okay, assuming this this is that type of game, she's not into me. <laughs> Whoa! That was not paying attention. That was cool. That was wicked. That, I never seen that in the visual novel. I, I like the introduction. That really caught me by surprise. I, I mean, wow, I'm, I'm really happy about that. The evil brat siblings finally appeared. The eldest son, Kyo. The second son, Nao. And the eldest daughter, Mio. Okay, so we got Kyo to the left. Nao to the middle. Now in the middle. <laughs> A TV show. <sighs> I, terrible, terrible, I know. And eldest daughter, Mio. Okay. A group of annoying neighborhood kids who only come here to go on wild rampages. <laughs> who does that? Well, I do that sometimes. I, well, I used to. <laughs> what? No, I wasn't. Now raises his voice. I have to look at my coil over my shoulder, and the remaining two hear it and lean all over me. I'm gonna suffocate. <laughs> Baka! <laughs> I just love that word for some reason. No, I am not a... Well, okay, maybe I am. Even the camera agrees, I think. Uh, that That's a sign that I need to, like, tell my camera otherwise, so... Yeah, I'll see you in a second. That will teach you, Mr. Camera. Anywho. Okay, maybe I am a... Maybe I am awesome pervert perverted one. I don't, whatever you also want to call me, anywho. <laughs> okay, so I figure out this is just it just says face. So I'm assuming that's like the face thing. I just recognize that by the way. And uh what's your name? Uh Mio or Mia? You are definitely right. <laughs> Hey, it's it's not. Oh, it is kind of sketchy. Thinking about it. our yeah, our shop is definitely sketchy. Wait, if it's sketchy, then why are you hanging around here in a sketchy shop? Then why do you why are you here? By the way, is that? Oh man, I don't know my Pokemon. I don't know my Pokemon. Uh, that looks like a Pokemon in the background. But at the same time, it doesn't look like. Okay, never mind. I'm I'm insane. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. No, Let, let's not do that. <laughs> I'm gonna resist. <laughs> this is fun. I'm not gonna lie, I'm having fun. This is great. I jolt up, legs wobbling, trying to shake them off. They don't care if I say they're childish. There's no way those kids would give up just like that. Well, they are a child, so they're children. What what thing are you pointing at? Uh, that that that. Uh, I think I know what you're talking about. That is meant for the bedroom. <laughs> well, that's very, uh, that's very sexist. <laughs> Their attention had already moved on to the other things. <laughs> I feel bad for their parents. They're a handful, I think. <laughs> Wait, completed? I was shocked when I looked at my coil. At some point, I started to display com a completion screen. Oh, yeah. I had a feeling I heard a strange sound from it a while ago. Maybe I accidentally pushed a button when I was messing with the kids. I hope I didn't download some strange program. That thing's connected to your arm. I hope you didn't download anything bad. I just stand there confused. The retro bell in the front door rings. The retro bell? How far are we in the future? Like, wait, the store manager Hagasan. Okay, so that's Hagasan, who had gone out for a delivery, was back. <laughs> that's so awesome! I like that. I love that. Oh, uh, 
You're the store manager. Why are you apologizing to me? Hagasan, smiling, fi uh, smiling face, droops when he sees the evil brats. Considering the damage they caused to the shop, well, it's a natural reaction. God, some of us suck to try to teach, you know, try to act nice towards them after what they did to your shop. <laughs> yeah, you better leave. He can kick you out. <laughs> Man, you, you, all three of you are scoundrels, and how did you get those? You guys, you three have scars. I don't want to know what you guys do in the outside of the store now. That's creeping me out. Yeah, I think it's too late. They're pretty hurt, as you can see. One has a cut on their forehead. Hugging some words in confusion, but the brats aren't listening. Oh, yeah. You think they'll listen? Yeah, he's wearing goggles for Christ's sake. I mean, come on. Justin. It's gonna end bad. Uh, you're noisy. Oh, don't call him baldy. I mean, it's accurate, I'm assuming. Uh oh. Does he not like being called that? Oh boy, he said it. The air around Hagasan freezes. Uh-oh. 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 I think they're gonna die. <laughs> Let us say our prayers for those three kids <laughs> who are last seen in the, in the junk shop. I, 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 I'm glad I'm not bald. <laughs> oh, wow, ballsy kid. <laughs> yeah, you better take it back. You go back home. You go back home. Oh, <laughs> damn. He is pretty intimidating. I give you that. The evil brats run out of the store at full speed. <laughs> he's yeah he, he's definitely losing it and I'm not talking about his hair <laughs> uh, tell him, oh yeah tell him about your sale I started talking and I heard them to the mumbling Hagasan. but what's S series and A parts I, I don't know that I don't like this. This vibe is weird. I wonder how you got those sales. <laughs> I wonder how that increase came along. Oh, is it cooling down? Is he cooling down? But I, yeah, I pretty he deserves a raise, <laughs> if I say so myself. Oh. Off a junk shop. Off a junk shop. A retro shop of that. Yeah, it's better than being bald. I, okay, if you're doubling in sales, should you have enough money? And assuming we're in the future, should you have enough money to get hair? Like, any growth type of thing? I mean, come on, by now, they would have to have that. Where? That The stock is full. What are you talking? Look around you. Psycho! After Hagasan lists this is my good news, he finally returns to normal. What a relief! That was dangerous. Hagasan is so outraged that once he stopped, he begins to act violently. When he returned to his us usual state, he pushed up his glasses, raised his eyebrows, and laughed. Hmm. Extremely troubling, in fact. <laughs> I get. I. I. Well, you don't know. I. I'm not sure if it's. Uh, I'm not sure. I, you know, I'm playing this game. I'm not sure if I should say if it's Kawaii or not. I. I'm not really sure. I'm. I'm too nervous to mention that. I'm still surprised. No matter how many times I see him change to almost a different person, I think it's said that people like that are fast to flip the switch. It flipped the bean. Okay, that was uncalled for. <laughs> Goodness. Hagasan walks to the counter and picks a paper bag by his feet. I don't know what's wrong with me sometimes. <laughs> uh, oh, he's 
Okay. By the way, Hey, whatever works with you, boss. I was gonna say, do you see his pants on there? Is he just happy to see me, or does he actually have someone in his pocket? I, I'm just pointing that out there. I'm looking down at it. I'm kind of nervous to know if that's like, you know, if Godzilla actually woke up from his uh, slumber. If you know what I'm saying. Oh boy. Okay, yeah. Well, let's let's do. It. Let's talk about something else. <laughs> I pick up my bag next to me and take the paper back from Hagasan. As I check the slip, I notice the destination is a bit far. This is a package going to the courier. Arigato. For sure. All right, boss. I got this. I bow at the widely smiling Hagasan and step outside. The time display on my coil reads 3 p.m. Some people mingle in this area, even though it's a back street. This is like the perfect junk shop, like ever. Like, you're in a mingle area. You have a guy who just gets sales off his voice alone. I mean, come on. And he's a liquor. Let's be real here. He's a liquor, so I mean, this is like the perfect place. Like, talking about like using your like location to advantage. There are several routes I could use to get to the courier. I wonder which would be the fastest. I take a soft lump of fur with both of my hands from my bag on my shoulder. Oh, oh, you just, it's so cute. While holding this sleeping lump of fur, I started up by pressing my hand against his forehead. Oh, oh, Ren, Ren. When I call him, he opens his deep black eyes with a click. Whoa, that gave me the chills. I did not expect this is like a robotic fox. It's adorable, but that that voice that I did not expect that suddenly then lightly touches his in my upper arm. Okay, so in the future, our GPS is going to be a real animal. So Who'd have thought? Thank you. Uh, yeah, thank you. When I pat his head, Ren barks once and wags his tail. I mean, that's pretty cool if your pet could talk to you. Now that is awesome, actually. What's that? Uh, catch goat te- Oh, I hope this is not copyrighted. This is really- this is like the coolest thing ever, like to end this intro. This is awesome. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I am greatly impressed right now. Wow, this is so cool. I'm seriously like happy that I'm playing this. I never thought I'd be saying that after like hearing all about it. Ooh, who are you? Oh man. Ooh, okay, we got. Okay, I I'm seeing the characters we got. Hmm, that guy kind of reminds me of, uh, what was that movie? I forgot the movie, uh, that terrible movie, Battlefield Earth, I think that's what it's called. Oh my goodness. This game's gonna be one interest. I'm assuming that was our granny, I, oh my gosh, we got twins. We're, we're gonna lose it. The future looks bright, though. The future definitely looks bright. I am looking forward to it. I right, look at this. Okay, that looks like Tommy Lee. <laughs> I'm just putting that out there. That guy looked like Tommy Lee. But man, the song though. Oh. Oh. So we got some dirtiness going on. We got some rough scenes, if you know what I'm saying. This is so freaking awesome. This is the intro. This is so cool. Like, this is the best intro I've, like, experienced yet from any visual novel game I played. By far the best one. Wow. Wow. How come this is not on Steam or anything? Like, instead of going through that whole process, which is not that hard, by the way, to play this game, but hey, I'm not going to complain. This is awesome. If I end up liking this, I'll probably watch the anime, which may or may not be a great idea. 
But that was cool. That was freaking wicked. Yeah, Harry Potter reference. Okay, the best way to travel around here is by foot. It's what everyone. It's what everyone does. The transportation system in the old residence district is pretty bad. There's a big street running through the center of the city, and sometimes there may be a bus or train or even a taxi. But they also can be canceled or delayed without notice, so they're not really reliable. The roads might be blocked at any time too, so nobody trusts public transportation. Even now, there are hardly any cars on the street. There's only one taxi way in the vein, and some junk cars parked by the roadside. The sidewalk is filled with people coming and going. The most reliable thing you can have are your own legs. So I'm assuming either one, the future just decides like, screw cars, we're gonna use our feet, finally, and public transportation, or two, the city just doesn't like to drive. I, I, I don't know where we're at. Well, we're in Japan somewhere. I know that. I just don't know where. Um, the hopeless old resident district is divided into north, south, east, and west. They're similar, but have some differences. R18. I kind of want to go there now. <laughs> For example, the east district where both Haibon and Homar is a residential area mixed with parts of downtown. The whole district is relat relatively safe and it's easy to get your hands on various things. What type of things? The North District is off limits area and has become something like a ghost town. It's unsafe. Well, that's weird to have just a ghost town on the. just right there and smack in the town. Like, doesn't. that's just really weird to me. Don't you agree, camera? No? You don't agree with me, camera? Okay, fine. The West District is a residential area, but you can't really do any shopping there. Okay? The South District is full of clothing shops, game arcades, and entertainment facilities. So a lot of young people go there. Well, we're young, so we should definitely go by there. Camera, you agree with that, right? You want to shake your, you want to shake the camera head? Yeah, you go and do that. And if you further go further than the North District, there's a Platinum Jail, a place full of celebrities and corporate purveyors. What purveyors? Sorry, pervers. Per well, there probably is perverts in there, but that's a jail. That looks like a really nice jail. I'm, I'm just been out there. Platinum Jail is one of the five Japanese conglomerate, uh, conglomerates. And when Toh, Inc. bought this island, Midor Rejima, they transformed into members-only entertainment area. If the stories I heard true, everything there seems to be luxurious. Okay. So in the Oval Tower, standing in the center of the city, there are, huge, there are huge casinos, movie theaters, shopping malls, hotels, Anyway, it's packed with all sorts of things. Okay, so I probably want to go into that area. That's apparently a, a, it's a jail, a good jail. I don't, I don't understand. Basically, you can't become a member unless you're invited. But the membership fee is about enough to buy this whole island, or so I've heard. Of course, people here in the old resident district can't get into the platinum jail. Okay, so it is a jail, but it's like a very, very like amazing jail. That's. A privilege to get in. The old resident district is, so to speak, almost like a slum, so it's tentatively managed to the degree that barely anyone can live there. But that's it. And yeah, here, I'll, I'm gonna fix the camera. I'll see you in a second. And it's fixed. Woohoo! Okay, the police only act big, are teamed up with Yakuza, and do whatever they want. So there's a huge difference between here and Platinum in Jail. That, 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 yeah, it's actually a big difference. I would like to live in a platinum jail now, please. It's like, it's not like we can do anything about it. Even if we're unhappy, we can't do anything but endure and swallow it. Now, that's terrible. So, this kind of reminds me of that movie, uh, Elysium, I think. Yeah, Elysium. Even so, it's often said that there is no place like home. So, once you get used to it, living here is unexpectedly comfortable. We're not cornered so badly that we can't live. We have our nice days. I don't wish for much. I don't mind if it continues like this. The people in the old resident district live... live or live live thinking like that. Alba. Oh, Alba. you know my name? Okay, so I'm Alba or Oba. Rain pokes his head out of his bag and taps my arm with his paw. Now that's adorable. Yeah, what's the matter? Okay, what's the, what's the problem with that, Rain? Well, Alba, I'm glad you take care of Ren really well. Uh, okay. I, I'm not a grease monkey, so I really don't know what they're talking about. 
<laughs> that's cool to have your pet talk to you. Whether I don't know, I actually think about that. That, that might be a bad idea. I involuntarily smiled and Ernest answered and stroked his head. Rain is a type, a uh, dog type all mate. All mates are artificial life forms with intelligence, generally used as support for network tools. They can search the internet and virtual space for information, and of course, they can also be used to shop online. Depending on the model, it's also possible to use one as a helping hand around the house, and they play an active part as a partner in a net game called Rhyme. Now that is really cool. Wow, I said it in the most Japanese way ever. Rhyme. It rhyme. <laughs> That's awesome, actually. That's pretty damn cool. There are many types of all mates. Among them are animal types which have different forms. Many people love them as pets. Ren and I have been together for quite a long time, too. I'm not exaggerating to say I would even call my partner. Even as it all makes to improve and new models comes out, I wouldn't abandon Ren even if hell froze over. Oh, I have a loyal pet. I love it. This, that makes the game perfect. GG. We have a perfect dog. Or fox. Or I'm not sure. Is it a dog, dog or fox or a dox? Is that even a thing? I don't know. But anyways, awesome ones. Before we hit the street... I have to stop here because it's been 30 minutes long. I think we've went through a lot and I'm excited to see what happens next. So I did hope you enjoyed this episode of Dramatical Murder. If you did, go ahead and leave a like and share the video if you did enjoy. Don't forget to see you I'll see you later. And let me know what you think about this so far. I think this looks pretty freaking awesome. I mean, I am greatly impressed on how amazing it looks and how it runs and this, just the characters so far. The characters are very interesting. So I'm excited to learn more about it. And... Yeah, I'll see you later, Sakota Spirit, and vocal reaction, and I'll see you with Gao Cow, and yeah, back to this. Dramatical murder. Woohoo, it's here. All right, love you. Don't forget to stay awesome. Bye. AP1. Huh? It's not what you think. It is not what you think. It was only a friendly thing because I needed a damn book, and I don't like going by myself. Oh, my God.